Let's welcome back to the channel. Today we have got our brand new series on the channel. It is the Zach Wilson New York Jets career mode and let's get into it. So we're going to start in the offseason here. Just going to go through the quick retirements. But yeah, we are doing a career mode with Zach Wilson, of course, the quarterback from BYU. We don't know if he's going to be a Jet in real life. I think he probably will. It's either going to be him or Sam Darrell next year, of course, for the Jets. I don't see Justin Fields going here. So we're going to do the Jets and we're going to start here with the offseason. And yeah, like I'm trying to re-sign all of our guys our core pieces here on the defense no one wants to come back to the Jets guys did not have a fun experience last year being the second worst team in the NFL and I don't blame them why they don't want to come back to the New York football Jets this team's not very good let's try to get Perriman back he doesn't want to come back either yeah no one's trying to come back to the Jets so let's go straight to free agency we're gonna make some moves here we're gonna pick up Leonard Fournette Lombardi Lenny is joining the New York Jets next up we're gonna try to pick up a wide receiver let's go get Tim Patrick didn't drop a single ball last year for the Denver Broncos want to bring him on to the team got a pretty good offer for him we are the only team trying to get him now we're going to try to get a left outside linebacker for the defense as we will try to bring in Tyus Bowser and also folks if you are new to the channel here first make sure to hit the subscribe button down below and leave a like but also if you are new to this um, career mode series that we do we've done this in the past with Tom Brady and with Trevor Lawrence we are only going to be playing offense in this series but of course it's still important to build up our defense for the sim so we're going to try to get William Jackson and Tony Jefferson the second as well and let's see oh also gotta get a kicker I'm not gonna roll with Castillo this year gonna bring in Will Lutz the former New Orleans Saint can get a pretty good offer on him we'll try to pick him up on the team and here we go so Tim Patrick accepts Jackson Bowser Jefferson Fournette everyone is joining the team everyone's becoming a New York Jet and Will Lutz as well so the second role here of free agency I'm gonna try to pick up Damian Wilson to play right outside linebacker should do the job and also at corner Let's bring in the former New England Patriot and Tennessee Titan in Malcolm Butler, of course, the Super Bowl 49 hero. All right, Butler and Wilson both will accept our offers, and it is time for the NFL Draft. But first, here is the New York Jets team. We are going to trade Sam Darnold in just a second here, but of course, our receivers are going to be Patrick and Jamison Crowder for now. The defense, let's be honest, is not very good. We have Quinn and Williams playing right end, but other than that, it's not very good. Will Jackson's here as well. All right. Here's our trade for Sam Darnold. We're going to get rid of him. The Colts don't have a quarterback with Phillip Rivers retiring. He didn't retire in the version of the game, but he's not a Colt anymore. We're going to send a third-round pick in Sam Darnold for a first-round pick this year for the Colts. Not a horrible deal for us, of course. You kind of want a little bit more out of a guy you once thought was going to be your franchise quarterback and a former first-round pick, but in the end, the market for Sam Darnold was just not great. I mean, the only other team that I think was interested was the Chicago Bears, who will be starting Nick Foles this season. We had to do it. We had to get rid of him. We will take the first-round pick from Indianapolis have fun with Darnold Carson Wentz is not there in this version of things so here comes the draft Trevor Lawrence gets picked by the Jaguars as expected and then of course we're going to take Trey Lance man North Dakota State joking here comes Zach Wilson the quarterback from BYU his player model is not very good I'm gonna fix it up a little bit I mean to the best of my abilities but yes here he is 77 overall fourth um overall I guess in the draft we'll take it welcome to the team Zach Wilson he should have superstar depth all right, we have two more first round picks. Here is the second. I'm going to take a wide receiver. We're going to take Rashad Bateman, the man out of Minnesota, played really well um, a couple years ago with Tyler Johnson for the Golden Gophers. He's not bad, 74 overall, hidden development. I don't know what that is. That's either star or superstar. Hopefully it's superstar. But yeah, welcome to the team, Rashad Bateman. That will help a lot. And let's also pick up Trevon, of course, strong safety from TCU. He's actually going to be a backup this year, but he was still on the board, 72 overall. Hidden dev, I do believe that is superstar or star. I'm not sure. I think it's superstar. And now in the next round, we're going to take Asante Samuel Jr., 69 overall, nice, but normal dev. What are you going to do about it? He'll be all right for us. And then we're going to take Liam Eichenberg here from Notre Dame. He does have hidden development, though. 70 overall, we will take it. Um, I do believe in the third round, and that was really the draft. We took Charlie Kolar deep in the draft, so he'll be our third string tight end. Nothing really notable, though, for the rest of the draft. And here's the team going into week one in just a couple seconds here. It should be a good one. There is Zach Wilson. I changed up the player model. That's the best I could get it. You can't give him the headband, too. It sucks. Madden's customization is terrible please just give us like Madden 12 customization where we can actually give Zach Wilson a headband nothing we can do for now but here we go it's week one we are at home here at MetLife Stadium and look who we are playing 
we're taking on Trevor Lawrence and the Jacksonville Jaguars. So it is the two worst teams in the NFL from last season. Going at it in New York, you got the number one overall pick versus the number two overall pick in the very first game of the regular season. Don't get me wrong, but I do believe this is the first time where the number one pick and number two pick were both quarterbacks and they're both playing each other in week one. I don't think that's ever happened before. Well, it is here tonight. We got Wilson. We've got Trevor Lawrence. Trevor Lawrence was the consensus number one player in this draft class. Well, here we go. Zach Wilson is trying to prove everyone wrong why he should have been the number one pick. But of course, we're happy that we did get him here in New York. And yes, that's Doug Marone, the new coach for the Jets. Not in real life, of course, is now Robert Sala. But of course, Madden does not have coordinators in the game. So you can't make Robert Sala the head coach for the Jets. You gotta go with Doug Marone. I mean, it doesn't really matter. There's James Robinson, of course, the star from the Trevor Lawrence career mode. Let's get into this ball game, though. So the Jets start off with the football here. It'll be a handoff to the new running back, Leonard Fournette, the first play of the new season. Fournette will take the Jets down to the 21. Now, a second and four for Zach Wilson. He'll be rolling to his right, looking to run. He can take off 10 rushing touchdowns last season for BYU, and he will pick up 12 on the ground down to the 33-yard line. First and 10 now for the Jets. Wilson dropping back, looking to throw. He's got some time. We'll fire away right side. It is going to Tim Patrick. The first ever completion for the career of Zach Wilson. Down out of the 49, it's a third and four for the Jets. Wilson going to drop back, going for a screen to Lombardi Lenny. And Leonard Fournette will pick up the first down to the 42. Third and 10 out for the Jets from the 42-yard line. Wilson looking, going to roll to his right. He's going to take off. No, he's going to pass it. He's got his man. It's the rookie, Rashad Bateman. The first round pick connection will pick up the first down to the 16 yard line. But now the Jets have a third and 11. So Wilson out the gun, looking to throw, sitting in the pocket, going for Jamison Crowder. It is to no avail. And now the Jets will go kick a field goal. Will Lutz is out. It is up and it is good. And the Jets go up 3 0. And the Jaguars still can't put any points in the board. So the Jets get it back here on a first and 10 as Wilson will roll to his right. Maybe going to think about running. He will again. And Zach Wilson. Gonna show off the speed. He'll pick up a gain of 14 down to the 34 yard line. Now, third and 11, though, for the Jets. Wilson again out the gun, looking to throw. He's got some time, but around the edge, he's gonna go down. Oh, man. And the Jaguars are gonna force the Jets to punt the football back to Jacksonville, where the Jaguars will put up three points. We got a tie game here at three to three. And there's Leonard Fournette, gonna lose two yards, and he's injured on the play. All right, so I know what happens. Yeah, he's out for nine weeks. So the new starting running back for the Jets is the man out of Maryland, Ty Johnson. Yeah, he got some snaps last year with Frank Gore in and out of the lineup, and somehow that pass is completed downfield. Oh, my goodness. There goes Wilson to Bateman again, down to the 42. Now, first and 10 for the Jets. Handoff to Ty Johnson, and Johnson over the middle going to pick up more yards than Fournette did in this entire ballgame so far. Give Johnson the first down to the 29. First and 10 now for the Jets. Wilson out the gun, looking to throw, going to roll to his left, trying to buy himself some time. Wilson going to take off again. He'll pick up the first down and more. He will head out of bounds at the 12-yard line, so a gain of 17 for the quarterback. Now a second and 16. Play action fake for Wilson. Rolling to his right, looking to throw. He's got a man. It's caught by the tight end, Ryan Griffin, to the four-yard line. Now a third and one for the Jets. Here from the four-yard line, out the gun. Wilson, handoff, Ty Johnson gets in. And the New York football Jets score their first touchdown of the season. They have gone up 10-3 to now on the Jaguars. And they get the football here, the next possession, at the 48. So a second and nine for Wilson over the middle. Finds Ryan Griffin again for the first down into Jags territory to the 36-yard line. First and 10 now for Wilson. Again out the gun, looking to throw. Going to step back, going for it all. Deep shot, Tim Patrick. The former Denver Bronco hauls it in. And the Jets score again. It's the first passing touchdown of the career for Wilson. And they're up by 14. And again, they force a Jags turnover. So they have it at the 40. That'll be a first down completion to tie Johnson to the 32. Setting New York for a second and nine here. From the 31 yard line, Wilson gonna drop back again. We'll find his receiver for the first down. It's Chris Herndon to the 20 yard line, making out first and 10 from the 20 yard line. Play action fake for Wilson. Looking to throw. He's got 10 seconds left here in the half. Rolling to his right. He's got a man cross body. He finds him. Jamison Crowder gets two in. 
and the Jets extend their lead to 21 by a score of 24 to 3. And they get the football again into Jags territory on a third and 10. Play action fake for Wilson, rolling to his right. He's just got to throw it away. And the Jets will punt the football back to the Jags as they do score seven. So it's a 14 point game. There goes Ty Johnson again to the outside. There we go, our running back. Picking up a gain of 19 to the 44 yard line. Give him the first down. Now on to the fourth quarter. It's a second and nine for the Jets. Back to the run game we go. And the juke moves by Ty Johnson. Give him the first down and get to the 46. Hey, man, I think we found something right here. Unfortunately, with the injury of Leonard Fournette. But we will take Ty Johnson's production out the backfield. Now a third and 12, though, for Wilson. He's got nowhere to go with the football. He'll step out of bounds. Actually lose a yard on the play. And the Jaguars will get the football back. Just to give the football right back to Zach Wilson again. So a first and 10th of 30-yard line. Wilson going to step up in the pocket. Still on his feet, shaking off two tacklers. He's still going. Wilson to the 14-yard line. This man is a monster. The Jets now at the 16-yard line. First and 10. Back to the run game. They go. Ty Johnson, the juke moves. Oh, my. Give him another first down. Ty Johnson's explosiveness out the backfield really showing up here tonight. Now a third and goal, though, for the Jets. Play action fake for Wilson. Rolling to his left. He will hit Chris Herndon. Herndon will not pick up the first down or get in the end zone. So Will Lutz will come out for a chip shot, 21-yard field goal to put the Jets up by 17. He's got it. New York up 27-10 to as the Jaguars do score another touchdown, but there's only a minute left in this ballgame. Third and five for Wilson, rolling to his right, looking for Jamison Crowder. It's incomplete, so Will Lutz comes out for a 42-yarder to put the Jets up by 13, but he misses it. So the Jaguars get the football back. And yeah, they're going to score a touchdown, but it's not enough. They don't have enough time. And the New York Jets will win this ball game. Almost blew that lead in the end, but it was important we got that field goal from Will Lutz because they will win this ball game by a score of 27 to 24. We win here on our home opener and, of course, our season opener. And the first ever ball game for Zach Wilson as a member of the New York Jets. And Wilson will beat Trevor Lawrence here in week one, which is absolutely huge. As for the stats for Zach Wilson, a solid ball game man about 215 yards for him on the day compared to Trevor Lawrence I do believe had about 270 both quarterbacks had a very good first game but there you go Zach Wilson hyping up the Jets crowd yeah 221 two touchdowns we will take it 124 pass rating for him too incredible ball game for the rookie out of BYU. And folks, that'll do it for the first episode here of the Zach Wilson Career Mode on Madden 21. Make sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you are new to the channel. Also, make sure to hit that like button down below if you did enjoy the video. Again, folks, thank God for watching, and Mamba forever.